offending anyone. Hello everybody, Tom here, I hope you're well. Today we're going to discuss the age-old thing about differences of opinion and about how I feel sometimes in this day and age people are walking on eggshells too much, worrying too much about how they may offend somebody. Look, at the end of the day I don't think anybody goes out of their way to be deliberately diversive, divisive, sorry, or offend anyone on purpose. Nobody really does that. There are some that do that, but personally, these people are very few and far between. We live in an age where everything is hypersensitive. There are people literally being offended over really stupid things, in my opinion. And, you know, the age-old thing is that it is okay to disagree. It is okay to agree to disagree. It is okay to be completely not on the same page as somebody else. And to amicably just go, okay, that's you, but this is me. Sadly, not everybody is okay with that. And a lot of people now will do everything in their power to try and influence you, change your opinion, and shame you into their way of thinking. And then there's the really extreme side of it, where if you don't agree with somebody or agree with something, you will end up getting seriously punished for it. That, for me, is not what our generations before fought for in world wars they fought for the right to have an opinion they fought for the right to have your own voice they fought for the freedom that we have taken for granted for so long they didn't fought, fight for somebody in school to have a difference of opinion and then end up getting expelled they didn't fight for that that is totally and utterly madness in my opinion okay sadly the way that we are living the way that we process and think now is probably going to be here to stay and it's probably going to get worse before it gets better and a lot would say in the younger generation that i'm a dinosaur and that my way of thinking is old and like and antiquated and that I shouldn't be listened to but at the end of the day it isn't about listening it's about learning to accept others point of views learning to accept the differences that we all have and learning to coexist amicably without fighting one another trying to force each other into uh, opinion on someone else debate is healthy Having differences is healthy, but there is a point where people need to understand that that is alright and not be trying to completely and utterly change somebody else to suit them. I don't mind if anybody disagrees with me, because I have the intelligence to try and see it from their point of view, maybe see how they've arrived at their opinion, and then just agree to disagree and amicably still be decent enough to get on with that person or to at least try so as it's my last video of the week you can see here I, I'm I'm preaching a little bit about how we should be more peaceful and accepting when we don't agree with each other how we shouldn't worry about offending each other because inevitably there are a lot of people in the world, a lot of different opinions, a lot of different life experiences, 
it is inevitable whether you want want to accept this or not, whether you can take this or not, that you will at some point offend someone with something you say and something you do. Don't be angry and guilty on yourself for doing so. Just know that sometimes it can't be helped. And absolutely, stand in the power of your opinion. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. But know when the point is to agree to disagree. And know when you may be taking it too far. Because we all want to be heard, we all want to be valued. And we all want to believe that there is some some point to what we're saying that justifies why we feel the way we do. That really is it for today's video. You will offend somebody, whether you like it or not. You shouldn't worry about it. As long as you're not going out of your way to be that aggressor. If it's said and it's meant tongue-in-cheek which happens a lot, just know that, you know, it is just inevitable that somebody won't like what you say or do. And that's life. Guys, third and final video of the week, I want to say thank you all ever so much for listening. I really appreciate your time and energy spent here on my channel. Thank you kindly. Third and final video, put down in the comment section below, are you someone that is concerned when they offend somebody? I am to an extent, but I also accept, as, as my video has said, that it's very difficult to not go throughout life without disagreeing with someone to the point where perhaps they are offended. It's very difficult. And if you manage to go through life not offending somebody, even when it's unintentional, you have done really well. And I'll pat you on the back for that. Remember, remember to hit that subscribe button down below. Leave me a thumbs up and a like. And let's hear that bell sign go when you know, so you know when my next content's out. I'll be back next week with another free videos. But as always, thank you all ever so much for listening. I really appreciate your time and energy spent here on my channel. Back with another free videos next week. Till then, please take care of yourselves. And bye for now.